Hey Bass Geek here and we are at the Raleigh Bass and Saltwater Expo. Well, we're not there right now. Something happened to my audio for the intro when I was down there and it's garbage. So I'm doing an intro right now, but the good thing about this is, is I get to tell you guys how much I appreciate everybody that showed up down there that came out to see the old Bass Geek, man. I can't tell you the positive vibes. You know, it's incredible to me to see how many of you guys come out. And that's what these videos, these expo videos are about for me. It's about giving back to you guys, putting you guys out there on the camera because this is your channel. It is not mine. I say that a hundred times. I mean it from the bottom of my heart. This channel is about you and about helping you and about you helping me become better anglers. Now, I do want to give a shout out to TRC because without them taking me down there, I wouldn't get to come down, hang out with you guys, talk about fishing with you guys, and, and, and meet a lot of other people. And on the other side, I want to give a big shout out to all the companies that did interviews with me. I want to give a big special shout out to Mr. Gary Milken because as you can still hear, my voice isn't 100% back. And, you know, so so generally I get down there and I talk so much that I lose my voice. Uh, that's, I think that's from 13 years of coaching football and screaming at kids all day. But anyway, so the point I'm trying to make is thank you from the bottom of my heart. Thank you, TRC. Thank you, uh, Gary for doing a couple of the interviews toward the end of this because I had no voice left and it hurt to talk. But trust me, no matter what, it never hurts me to talk to you, members of the Bass Geek Nation. Now, all that being said, guys, make sure you come out to Knoxville. It's the 23rd through the 26th. Unfortunately, Ledgehead isn't gonna to get to make it, but guys, you know I love to talk about uh, Ledgehead products. I will be in the TRC booth. So we'll talk about some good, good, the best rod covers out there. Now, so come down Knoxville, Tennessee, East Tennessee Fishing Expo. Come down there or up there, whichever part of the country you're in. Just come to Knoxville, hang out with me. I will have stickers, but this is all I got left. So I don't know how long they'll last over a four day expo. So last but not least, this will be the last expo I do this year. Make sure you come to the Augusta County Fishing and Outdoor Expo, which is in Fishersville, Virginia. Come up there, this is the first year I'm doing that. I'll be working bass munitions up there. So we'll get to talk about all their awesome soft plastics. You know, I'm a huge fan. I will also be doing a seminar on the Domeki rig when I get up there. And if they decide, who knows, we might even talk about some swim bait fishing, maybe the underspin, which is something that I love. So we will be doing a seminar at least on the Domeki or drop rig. So make sure you get to Fishersville, Virginia. That is February the 15th and 16th. So it's only two days. Get up there. I'll see you. Now, let's go see some of the cool products that I found in Raleigh and some of the cool people I got to meet too. Hey guys, Bass Geek here, and I am with one of the daggum men, one of the best anglers out there. And if you don't believe me, all you gotta do is you gotta go watch the MLF where he put one of my favorite deep diving crankbaits to work. Oh yeah, hey, I, I, I paid him $10 for that intro, but <laughs> hey, it'll work. <laughs> what he don't know is he didn't have to pay me a dime. <laughs> Hey, hope everybody's doing good, man. Enjoying the channel. And, uh, man, just keep clicking subscribe, keep watching. Thank you. And uh, appreciate the plug. Right. Thank you, brother. Dude. A little Z-Boss action. Z-Boss or the boss let me That's tell you. Right. No brother, I appreciate you. More than welcome. Dunn got his, uh, his trophies over here. Yeah, I got a few Let yeah. me tell you, I picked that one up. I, I'm still sore from it. It's heavy. It's heavy. It's heavy. <laughs> Thank you, brother. Hey, you bet, man. See hey, you uh, shout out some of your uh, social media. Yeah, hey, go check us out. Um, uh, Instagram, Facebook, all the channels, at Timmy Horton Bass. Uh, always have tips on every day. I love to teach. Yes. Man. Love to teach. So always give me tips on there. Uh, go subscribe to our YouTube channel as well. So, all right, man. Down. 
appreciate right, you. you got. Hey, Gary here with the basket. He's lost his voice, so I'm kind of doing a little intro to him. And we're here with a very special person, Jacob Coley, the newest member of Team Fish Sticks and Team Special Ops Survivors. He got his fishing rod. And guess what, dude? We're here at the TRC, which is a Texas rod cover booth. And we're here supporting the Texas rod cover. You know something about the covers? What do you know? They fleet. They float. That's right, man. And did you get did you get you a cover? Yeah. What you think, there, Basket? Well, I don't know if you can even hear me, but I think it's great. I appreciate you, man. I appreciate you coming by. I appreciate you being on the channel. Yeah, we're on the channel. You watching. So you got to come and watch us. And come to the uh, Saltwater Fishing Expo up here in Raleigh and come and see Jacob, and he's going to be at the TRC booth. Take care. Until next time. Hey, Bass Geek here. I am with one of my loyal Bass Geek Nation subscribers. He come out here to the Raleigh Expo to talk with me. Introduce yourself, brother. Dwight Stevenson. You got anybody you want to say that? I want to say hey to your kids? Uh, shout out to my kids, Zach Stevenson, who watches a lot of your videos as well. And the rest of my kids, too. All right, man. Thanks for coming by. Thank I you. appreciate you. Hey, guys. Bass Geek here. And I'm with one of the Bass Geek Nation loyal subscriber. And uh, I do have stickers. And he's going to get a couple. As many as he wants. So y'all should have been here. <laughs> Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hey, man. I'm Brian Hershberry. And I'm here with one of my big heroes. This is oh. absolutely Bass Geek, man. So, Bass Geek Nation is living strong. <laughs> Amen. So, where are you fishing at? What are you? Give us your GPS coordinates. <laughs> yeah. Well, mostly Falls Lake, Jordan, and, uh, and Sharon Harris. Listen, I think uh, Major League Fishing popped the top on those lakes. Everybody yeah, knows about them, right? Yeah. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm going to come down here and try and find all your spots on those lakes now. I can't I'm wait. For you. I can't wait. Man, I appreciate you stopping by. You want to say hey to anybody? Hey, Danny. Hey, Lila. I hope you're doing well. All right. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Hey, Bass Geek here, and I am with one of the Bass Geek Nation, one of my loyal subscribers. What's going on? Hunter Gatewood. You got anybody you want to shout out or say hi to? Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. <laughs> there you go. Man, appreciate you yes, watching. Sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right. Hey, guys. I've helped you out with his hummingbirds. Make sure you go back and check out the hummingbird videos that I've done in the past. And also, go tell hummingbird they are to play nice with me. Hey, Bass Geek here, and I'm with one of my Bass Geek Nation loyal subscribers. Tim Gill. And Tim, you got anybody you want to shout out? Uh, Critical Fishing, uh, Balsack Fishing Line, down here at the Raleigh, North Carolina uh, Fishing Boat Show. Having right. a great time. Well, I appreciate you coming by, man. Appreciate you watching the channel. Guys, you got any uh, social media you want to share with uh, My Facebook, Timothy Ray Gill. There you go. Go check him out. The man is a stick. Appreciate you, brother. All right, thank you. Hey, guys, Bass Geek here, and I'm with one of the Bass Geek Nation, a loyal subscriber. Met him down here last year. I'll let him introduce himself. Hey, I'm David Buffalo from Wendell, North Carolina. I'd like to say a shout out to all the members uh, of the Carolina Crackers Bass Club. There you go. All right, guys. Now, I hope all those members are subscribers to Bass Geek. <laughs> but, man, I appreciate you coming by. Yes, sir. I appreciate you watching the videos. It means yeah. the world to me. Hey, guys. Bass Geek here, and I have found an amazing product, something that I'm going to pick up myself. So, you know, spoiler alert for the unboxing here a little later. But I am with Jimmy and Tom, and they're going to talk about the line defender. Hey, how you doing? My name is Jimmy Mann from FL Lockout, and what we have now is the latest new technology in line defense, fishing line defense. It's called the line defender. And what I want to show you is how easy to do it. It's easy to install on your prop. Take the cap off, it rotates off of your prop, goes back on, caps on, mount to your motor, keep the fishing line out, and it's guaranteed. And we're at the show right now, getting ready to offer to the people that can use it. All right, guys, I'm telling you, this is a product that I am absolutely going to pick up because I the Mickey rig, and I was telling these gentlemen yesterday how many times I've got my line caught in my trolling motor, so I can't wait to get one. Now, where can they pick this up? We can pick, they can get it from our website right now, and our website address is? It's www.fishinglinedefender.com. Of course, we'll put all the links in the description of this video below so you can get out there and you can order you one of these. Anything else, guys? All right. You won't have to worry about fishing line problems anymore. 
Hey guys, I'm with, and I know that he needs no introduction, I'm with Mr. The Honorary, the best tournament angler in the world, Mr. Fat Cat Newton. Boom goes a dynamite. Ha 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 What's happening, Fisher World? Here with my main man, the Bass Geek, son. If y'all don't already know, you need to know, he is on fire. Doubled his subs in the past 12 months. This dude is hitting 30,000. By the time you see this, he'll be at 300,000. I don't know about that. Let's not get carried away. <laughs> but yeah, man, we, we, we met up. We're talking, and we just, like, what can we do? What can we do together to put a smile on your guys' face? I say we take our shirts off and rub nipples. <laughs> well, you know, I'm all for that, but... Family friendly. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you know, maybe, maybe I, we turn the camera I off. don't want to get demonetized. Yeah, after camera, <laughs> all the time. <laughs> hey, guys, listen. You guys are doing the right thing by watching my man. This dude, clean, family friendly. Kind of like myself. A little bit cleaner, a little bit more family friendlier. Friendly, friendly friendlier. A little bit more flimmy, but... I'm really flimmy. Yeah. Really flimmy. It's, you know, all the time. <coughs> Enough awkwardness. <laughs> Appreciate y'all. Appreciate Bass Geek. Follow him. Follow me. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Yeah, we're done. See you. Bye. Hey, it's John Purdue here at yeah. TRC Rod Covers. Come on out to Raleigh Bass Fishing Expo. Pick you up some TRC rod covers, cable covers. Uh, give them a try. These are high quality. Very good. They float. So come on out, keep your rods protected at all times. Come out and catch us at the Raleigh Expo. Hey man, appreciate you. Yeah man, anytime. By the way, this guy right here is a Bass Geek Nation subscriber, and he's a fellow, as he talked about, TRC staff member. Yes sir. Go check out TRC, guys. There's plenty of people that come by this booth and tell us how much they love them. And I'm definitely one of them. You've seen them in 100 videos. Thank you, brother. Thank you, man. Hey, Bass Geek here. I am with one of the Bass Geek Nation, one of my loyal subscribers. Uh, Richard Lovett from uh, Rocky Mountain, North Carolina. Anybody you want to shout out or say hey to? Hey, my buddy Scott in Ohio. He watches you a lot, too. Oh, hey, Scott. How's it going? Guess what? You're not down here. Guess what I gave this man? Show him them stickers. Yeah, look at that. Too bad, Scott. We gotta give Scott a little hey. Hey guys, I'm here with one of my loyal Bass Geek Nation subscribers. You got anybody you want to say hey to? Nobody. Uh, just watch this guy's video. He gives a lot of good knowledge while I'm out here on the water. He gives us good tips, man. Just keep fishing on. And never stop. There you go. Appreciate you, brother. Thanks for stopping by. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of my loyal Bass Geek Nation subscribers. Hey guys, my name's Drew Petrie from Boone, North Carolina, down here hanging out with Hank, learning about tight lining and the Mickey rig fishing. So keep it tight line, guys. Enjoy it. Well, say hi to anybody. Say hi to my brother Dustin, my dad Winston. Um, just love your channel, Hank. All right, man. I yeah. appreciate the heck out of it. Yeah. Hey, hey Bass Geek here. I'm with one of the loyal Bass Geek Nation. Jason Preston. Got anybody want to say hey to? Uh, my son Blake. He's actually out in Tennessee visiting on a church group. Oh, uh, hey Blake. In my part of the world. That's right. <laughs> Do some fishing. <laughs> Good luck. Good. Got anything else you want to say? No, hey, just down here checking out TRC rod covers. They look like they're really good uh, product. I uh, heard about them through uh, Bass Geeks channel. We look forward to trying them out. You guys know I love them. They keep me from buying new rods. And that's a big deal. Thank you, man. I right. appreciate you. Appreciate it. Hey, guys. Bass Geek here. And having a granddaughter and a daughter, of course, you know, my granddaughter, I'm sorry, but I'm going to make her a Bassmaster Classic Champion. So this may be the only girl that beats her to it. This is LBAA Angler. Dana Raven. And Dana, so tell us what your plans are for the season. What are you fishing this year? We're fishing Pickwick, Hartwell, um, I'm drawing a blank. The Natchitoches, however you say that. And uh, one in Missouri. Go look it up. Go look it up on oh, their right website. I, it's yeah, fine. Yeah, you're yeah. fine. What? What's their website? LBAA. Is yeah. it just LBAA? Lady Bass Anglers Association. There you go. Go check them out. Now, do you have any uh, social media? Your I do. Instagram? I do have a Facebook page. It's Dana Raven Fishing. You don't have an Instagram page? I'm not a fishing page. All right, guys, tell her in the comments. Get a daggum Instagram page. I have an Instagram, but it's not my fishing Instagram, so. Well, she needs to get a fishing page, too, all right? Okay, you all agree with me. I know you do. All right, so uh, you want to shout out anybody? Say hey to... Darren, Lieutenant Darren, 
the TRC for having us here. We do appreciate that. Alex and Alex. There you go. My parents for helping me get here. There you go. My own beauty shop. <laughs> you want about uh, other family, kids, anything? They say, hey. Oh, uh, yeah. My little boy, he's at home. Jason. Hope there he's feeling go. better. He's not feeling well. Oh, that stinks. You better, Jason, right? You said Jason. 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 Gotcha. Sorry, I'm also slightly deaf. I'm old. All right, guys, make sure you follow her on her on her uh, Facebook page so that you can keep up with her and see uh, how she does in the LBAA. And you you won a tournament there. Did you win or? Well, I've made the classic the last three years. There you go, classic competitor for I three years. I get seconds years. and thirds, but I think somebody's cursed me on the win, so I don't know. She is the Aaron Martins of the LBAA. <laughs> All right, thank you. Thank you. Hey guys, this is Darren Yao with TRC Covers. I want to introduce you to my product I have here. It's a rod cover that floats and offers rod tip protection. It has a tight weave, unlike what you might see at the regular stores. Keeps those guides protected. Also has foam at the tip. Your rod, rod tip goes up inside that uh, foam. It protects it, it floats. You can get custom logos on it. Hey, check us out on trccovers.com. Hey guys, Bass Geek here, and look who I'm with, Mr. Mike O'Neill. I lied, I am going to do it that way. That's <laughs> all right. All right. So what's up this year, man? Just, uh, you know, I've had a good off season, just been hunting a little bit, got to fish around the house. Um, don't get to do that a lot during the year, so uh, been rigging my boat. Just, I mean, just a little bit of everything, not a whole lot of anything. But a lot of everything so uh, looking forward to the year getting started though I mean we got a great schedule on the Bass Pro Tour and uh, some really big fish lakes we changed a little bit of the format this year uh, we're gonna have variable minimum sizes like it you follow the first event well, now, wait a minute. A I'm going to interrupt him. I'm going to interrupt him. Guys, who was the guy that's been recommending this and talking about this for for weeks and weeks and weeks and put it on there going, this guy right here, I did it. <laughs> we did. So, uh, I mean, you fall is going to be a two-pound minimum. And, it, I mean, we could go as big as a, a three- or four-pound minimum just depending on where we go. But it's just going to vary depending on the quality of the lake, right. how it's fishing, like uh, just general little deals. But, yeah. I mean, it's going gonna, it's gonna to make us fish for bigger fish. Yeah. And, I mean, there's no way about it. So it's going to be good. It's going to be interesting. It's going to be kind of learning it all over again. But uh, I'm excited either way. You know, uh, like I said, great schedule. You follow up Lake Fort, uh, Lake Champlain, St. Lawrence River, back over here in Raleigh at Jordan Falls and Sharon Harris. I uh, couldn't ask for much of a better schedule besides somewhere on the TVA. I have, I have to throw that in there, but uh, yeah, I mean, it's going to be good. I'm looking forward to it. Guys, Mr. Neal here is a friend of a friend of mine, Ledgehead Lures, by the way. Make sure you go check them out. And by the way, you can see it right above us. We both are TRC Rod Cover team, and uh, you guys know I, I cheer. I root for this guy. Uh, I have for a long time. He's a good guy. One of the best guys on any tour out there or in the world. I like old Mr. Neil, man. And plus, he's an IT guy, too, so, you know. <laughs> yeah, computer us, science degree. Us geeks, we stick together, <laughs> yeah. baby. Got to. Brother, Got to. Appreciate yep, you. Thank, thank you. you. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of my loyal, loyal subscribers hey, and man? Bass Geek Nation. I am Pablo, a.k.a. Bass Sicario, and uh, happy to see this man again. That's the second year in a row over here in uh, Raleigh Expo. And uh, just want to give a big shout out to my wife. We was on the channel last year. Well, this year we have a brand new baby. He's five days old. Uh, he's hanging around here somewhere. So definitely he had it right. It's gonna last. So uh, <laughs> I told you. That's right. That's right. So please subscribe to this man's channel, man. I uh, end up being four in my bass club thanks to him watching some channel, learning some good stuff. Thank Heck you. Yeah. Man. Thank you. So um, please come and check him out. And come and check out these guys over here at DRC Covers, all right? Hey guys, now remember, you, your YouTube channel, tell them one more time. Actually, I, I didn't get a chance to start my channel. Oh. I got busy with my kid. I hey, But uh, this who year. Wants to do that to you? That's right. Kids comes first. So uh, this year we are going to take it off and it's going to be on their Basicario TV. Guys, he had a little boy. He's got a permanent fishing partner now. Congratulations. Thank you, my man. Shout your wife out. Yes, shout out to my wife, Amanda. I love you, honey. You did great, and I'm so proud of you. You are an awesome mom. And she is awesome. I met her last year. I told him that it was going to last. Trust me. He remembered that. I, could, I forgot all about that. Thank you, brother. I appreciate you. Thank you.
Hey Bass Geek here, I'm with two of the Bass Geek Nation, two loyal subscribers. They come out to the Raleigh show. I'm gonna let them introduce themselves and shout out anybody or say hey to anybody. Daniel Ellis. Go ahead and say it again. Wife Maggie. All right. Now you guys want to say hi to anybody? Shout out to anybody? All right, so nobody's more important than them coming by seeing me. You guys just remember that family and friends. They're bass geeks. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> All right, guys, I appreciate y'all coming by. Yeah, man. No Thank you very much. <laughs> Pleasure to meet you. Hey, Bass Geek here. Guys, I'm with one of the loyal Bass Geek Nation subscribers. That's John Anderson. And you want to say hey to anybody? Uh, no, just all the Bass Geek fans. And all right. Channel. Appreciate, appreciate you coming by yeah, the booth, man. No Thank you for subscribing. Yeah. Appreciate you. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of the loyal Bass Geek Nation, one of my subscribers. Bert Inscott. You got anybody you want to say hey to? Uh, no, just uh, everybody here from Raleigh and Durham, North Carolina. That's about it. Uh, good some, to see you out here. I appreciate you coming by, man. Yeah, man. I know there's some good fishing. This guy is about to show me all the spots, give me the waypoints, so I can get on some good Raleigh Durham bass. Right. Thank you, brother. Yeah, man. Hey guys, Bass Geek here. I'm with some of my new subscribers. My name is John. Uh, hi, mom. <laughs> I'm Ben. Uh, add me on Snap, Benton Ray. Anything else? We'll say hi to anybody else. No. All right, man. Thanks for coming by. Appreciate you guys. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with a bunch of the Bass Geek Nation, some of my loyal subscribers. They're going to shout out some of their social media. Go ahead, guys. Uh, my YouTube channel is JSK Outdoors. Um, you guys should go check it out. Um, my YouTube channel is MRF Reckless. I do gaming and fishing. Go follow my Instagram, Eli Matheson 101. All right, guys. They yeah. stopped by the Raleigh. Go ahead, brother. Go subscribe to Bass Geek, too. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Man, they've been loyal subscribers for a very long time. I appreciate them. I love the young guys getting out there, getting on the water. I, I love the fact that they're tuning in to watch this old fat redneck hillbilly talk about bass fishing, man. I appreciate you guys. Hey, Gary here. We're at the Raleigh fishing expo and I'm, I'm i'm actually sitting in for the bass geek he uh he lost his voice i guess he's been talking so much uh through through social media and stuff and the his youtube channel he just lost his voice so he asked me to step in i'm i'm gary gamma pro for gamma fishing and guess what we got some of the best line out on the market today the floor carbon is phenomenal what i want to talk to you guys about is just that and here is the owner the myth the myth the legend dale <laughs> the gamma guy of all guys. What do you think, Dale? How's the show been so far? It's been a real good show this yeah, year. Yeah. You know, it's fun being down here. I've missed the last two years because my brother's been running it and I got to come down and see a lot of people that I haven't seen in a while and it's been a lot of fun. Speaking of your brother, I don't see him this morning. Uh, he was in the shower when I left. Oh, okay, okay. No worries, no worries. <laughs> so what's, uh, what's been on the, um, what's the hot seller this year for, for Gamma Line? Well, it's always our fluorocarbon is one of our best sellers. It's very unique. It's very uh, consistent, very yeah. strong, yeah, 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 but yeah. also you get some supple suppleness. If we didn't have that process we do, we wouldn't That's have right. anything different. So uh, on the what I, what I like to talk, what I know about Gamma is, so say you're fishing a, a 10 pound diameter or a, a correction, a 10 pound test or an eight pound test, you're actually, the brake strength, it's not actually 10 or 8 pound, it's the actual brake strength is about a pound and a half to two pounds larger, isn't it not? Yeah, it's the, it's again, <clears throat> it comes down to the process, but today almost all lines don't break at their exact strength. Right. They're going to break higher. The, the way they make it, the, the properties of the line, that's, even though it's still extruded and drawn down like they did in the 50s, the pro, the, right. the components themselves have gotten better and the machinery has gotten better so they're really able to add a lot more strength in the line. I think we need to show a little bit about the Gamma Edge and the Gamma Touch. Uh, I personally like, I fish a lot of the 16 and 14 pound edge, but I'm telling you the touch, the touch, he, I'm, I'm a big eight pound test guy and he said, Gary, I want you to try the seven pound touch and I'm starting to fall in love with it. 
That oh. seven is one of my favorites. And the big difference between the touch and the edge isn't the actual makeup or material of the line. It comes down to diameters. The touch was designed in, in half sizes to get to, and to be able to dial in those live bait presentations or drop shot, you know, really finesse applications. So like a seven pound touch, which is my favorite, is like a four and a half pound main line. Four and a half pound, that's huge guys. And what that does is that gives your bait more action in the water because it's not moving as, it doesn't have all the friction from the line size diameter and you get more strikes. Yeah, with the with the smaller diameter, <clears throat> you have uh, that stiffness is a lot less. Yeah. So you get that more natural presentation that you're looking for when you're drop shotting with those right. really finesse baits. That's right. So. Well, listen, guys, hey, we're not going to take up all of your time. Again, I'm filling in right now for the Bass Geek because his voice is shot. Mine's almost there, but I think I can make it through today. And I want to thank you, Dale, for coming out. Come and check us out. We're at the Gamma booth over here in the Raleigh Fishing Expo. Until the next time, we'll see you on the water. Hey, guys, I'm here with one of my heroes. This is the cranking legend. I mean, legend with the capital L, Mr. David Fritz. I'm going to let him say hey to you and throw you a tip or just say hey, I don't care. As long as he's on my channel, I'm happy. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all the people out there watching Bass Geek, man, you know, we're at the Raleigh Show, Killer Show. This is one of the good ones. So there's not many of them left, but this is a good one. So make sure you come out, come to some of the seminars. they got all kinds of tackle here. we got a few print side crank baits left. We've got blues, got anything you want to fish with. So come out and check these guys out. Guys, if you don't know this guy, you ain't a true bass angler. I'm just telling you. I'm just telling you. Love the guy. He is the crank master. Appreciate you, sir. Thank you very much. It was an honor. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of my super subs. Will Perryman. W Perryman 2 on Instagram. Hey, I want to say this. I came all the way to Raleigh to, to hook up with the Bass Geek. <laughs> and I am a bass geek, but I tell you, he turned me on to TRC a few years ago, and I started replacing my rod covers with TRC rod covers. Man, this guy hooked me up, and now I've got over a dozen of them, and I, of course I'm retired, so I'm going to need to get some more. I just have to stage it out. Great channel. Glad to be here, Hank. Man, I appreciate you. Always appreciate you guys coming out and talking to me. Love this guy right here. Love that he comments. Love that he talks to me. Like I said, super sub right here. He's awesome. Thank you, brother. Thank you. Hey, guys. Bass Geek here, and I'm with some, a bunch of the Bass Geek Nation. They are out here at the Raleigh Show. Guys, go ahead and introduce yourself. I'm Nathan. Caleb. Little Joe. Guys, you want to shout anything out? Any sort of your social media or anything? I'll let you boys. Yeah. I'll let them. Come on. Hi. <laughs> Say hey to anybody. Will and Skyler, holla. Yep. Hi, Skyler. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks for coming out. Thanks, Thanks for watching the channel. Really Thanks, sure. man. Hey guys, Bass Geek here. I'm with a couple of the Bass Geek Nation, some loyal subscribers. Guys, Anthony Barnes from Clayton, North Carolina, the greatest fisherman in North Carolina. Reggie Dobbins, a, a beginner. <laughs> modest, modest right here. I like it. And, but, but honest, that's honest too. The greatest fisherman in North Carolina. <laughs> Y'all want to say hi to anybody before we? Hello to Larry Flowers and the rest of the crew. And Diego. Hello, Grace Creek area. There you go. Guys, thanks for coming by. Appreciate you watching. Hey, Bass Geek here. And as you can tell, I've talked so much, I can barely, barely talk at all. I'm here with one of my subscribers. Casey Watson. You want to shout out anybody? Uh, Journey Outdoors, Lexington, Virginia. Uh, I'd also like to shout out uh, uh, One Objective, BassFishing.com. Uh, I'm also on their pro staff as well as TRC Covers. Uh, you want to say hi to anybody? I like my wife here dances with me and uh, I. Having a great time down here at the Raleigh Expo. So, 
y'all come on out. We got a few more minutes left here, and we're gonna have a good time. All right, man. Thanks for coming by. And Thank thanks you. for all the support. Hey guys, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of my subscribers. Mel, Mel Tulsa. You can follow me on Instagram at Mel Fishing. Any, any uh, uh, Facebook? Anything else? No, I don't have Facebook. Okay. Shout out to my good dad for bringing me here. All right. Well, and subscribe, and subscribe to Bass Geek on YouTube. Um, you can learn a lot, a lot from him. I've been watching him for about a month now. I found out his channel from Debo's Fishing. Subscribe to him too. Debo's great. Debo, you know I love you, bro. <laughs> Thank you, man. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with one of the Bass Geek Nation, one of my loyal subscribers. Mike White from North Carolina. You got anybody you want to say hey to? Yeah, I'm good. All right, yeah. man. Thanks for coming Thank out you, to the Raleigh Thanks Expo. So Thanks for watching the channel. Hey, Gary here, Fish Sticks Pro at the Raleigh Fishing Expo this weekend. And I'm kind of filling in for a little bit for my good old buddy, the Bass Geek. He, uh, he's been talking so much. Uh, the last couple of days, he's lost, his, uh, he's lost his, his vocal cords. So he asked me to fill in for him. And we're here at the Fish Sticks booth in Raleigh, North Carolina. And we're going to talk to you about some custom rods that are being built in Florence, South Carolina. And with me, I have the one, the only, Angela Mayo, Fish Sticks Pro from Fish Sticks. From Fish Sticks. Right? So, um, what does Fish Sticks, what's something a little bit different from Fish Sticks that say uh, you buy a little Walmart rod or something like that? What is a little bit, not saying that they're bad. No, of course but, not. But what's something different that we, that we have done? So for me personally, what I like the best about uh, Fish Sticks Custom Rods is that the name says it all, custom. Uh, I like my my handles a little bit shorter, so every rod that I have built is built to me to fit me to do what I need to do. And really, there's no really extra cost in that. They're building the rods anyway, so if they got a and and the biggest thing is basically when you hold the rod in your hand, where the butt ends in into your forearm, and for you, your forearm's different than say mine. Exactly. So a lot of shorter women. Uh, the rod handle might end up back here, right, and it's, right. it's hard to maneuver and, and do what you need to do. So, Wendy has measured from the palm of my hand where the real seat is to here, and every one of my rods, that's the length of the handle. Right. I also don't necessarily like really long rods for top water, things like that, because then I'm smacking the water. So, it, she will. I will tell her what I need, and yeah. she will build it exactly the length I want with the handle, whatever it is that I need it to be. So, what you're telling me is, well, what we're telling you is Dale and Wendy, they're the owner of Fish Sticks. They're in Florence, South Carolina. They touch and hand build every single rod to the direct specifications of the person that's buying it for a custom size. But we also have some awesome awesome and and we'll, and we'll show you these here in just a minute but some awesome our clear water series exactly the clear you the stock size that you could just come in pick them up off the rack and they're going to perform the way you need because they're also built by hand each one of them by dell and wendy even though right. they're a stock size <laughs> so for me as a fish sticks bro two rods that i would recommend anybody to get is the cb72 which is a phenomenal rod. We both have several of them. And I'm, I'm trying to get Angela, I'm working with Angela on the MB843. So that those are great all-purpose rods, but we have a tremendous amount of anything from a medium light with an extra fast tip to a uh, extra heavy with a fast tip. So we color all spectrums, saltwater rods, exactly. crappie yeah. rods, they, ha they have a whole new line of saltwater rods this year. Yeah. Although they have been building saltwater water rods for 40 years, they have now a whole line That's of right. those rather than them being specifically built for a person. That's right. So, hey, in a nutshell, you got to check out fishsticks.com. Uh, come and check us out if you want to at the Raleigh Expo. But, hey, more importantly, fishsticks.com, and uh, you can call them up. I'm, I'm sitting in. I'm trying to do a good job for the Bass Geek. Uh, Angela and Gary here for the Fish Sticks Pros, and uh, thank you, Bass Geek, for allowing me to try, try to fill some big shoes that you got, and uh, we'll see you next time on the water. Until then, take care. Hey guys, Bass Geek here. I'm with a couple of my loyal subscribers. I'm going to let them introduce themselves. I'm Drew Matthews. You guys got any uh, Instagram, anything you want to shout out? Uh, underscore Drew Matthews, underscore... 
That'll be it. Yep. <laughs> the importer dot locker. Shout out to the Pine Forest Fishing Team. There you go. That's right. All right, man. Thanks for stopping by, guys. Pleasure to meet you. Hey, Bass Geek here. Give my boys. It's day three. I'm with a couple of my subscribers. Scott. Uh, I'd like to shout out Bass Geek. Love the videos. Keep them up. Yes, sir. Appreciate the stickers. Yes, Come sir. Get y'all hey, man. Anybody y'all want to say hi to other than me? Yeah. No, we love the videos. Keep pumping them out. I know you got work and stuff yes, going sir. on, but... Keep going with them, brother. Thank you, man. Yes, sir. I appreciate you guys. Hey, Bass Geek here. I'm with a couple of the Bass Geek Nation subscribers. And I'm Ronnie McLeod. And I'm Thomas Stewart. If you guys want to say hi to anybody, shout out to any social media. Hey to everybody. All <laughs> oh, you bass anglers out there. All right, guys. Thanks for stopping by. Yes, man. sir. Appreciate it. Watching. I appreciate it. Hey Bass Geek here, I'm with one of the Bass Geek Nation. Hey, how you doing? I'm Kalita Sajla, big fan. Came by the booth, got me a couple of uh, rod uh, covers. Definitely uh, big ups. Enjoy the conversation, enjoy the channel, and uh, keep looking out for that future content. You want to shout anything out, man? No, that's it. All right. Appreciate you coming hey, by, you. Hey, Bass Geek here, and I'm with someone that doesn't need my in introduction, <laughs> Miss Snooky. You need to go check her out on Instagram. Go ahead and tell them where, where they want to find you at. Snooky Fishing on Instagram, and you guys, I just want to tell y'all, this guy's amazing. Like, he knows so much, and he has helped me with social media. Did you know he could do that? I mean, like, I thought I was a social media queen, but evidently, somebody is a lot smarter than me, so... We are going to tag team you guys, and we're going to start teaching some stuff, so stay tuned. Thank you. I wish you would go tell my wife how amazing I am, 26 years of marriage, and <laughs> you know. She loves you. She loves you. She's, she's dedicated. <laughs> Of course, I've learned I've learned the golden rule of marriage for that long. Just say you okay. Yes, <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you, guys. Make sure you go out. Make sure you follow her. I know 90% of you already do. Thank you. See you. Hey, again, guys. I just want to say thanks to everybody that come out. Not everybody wants to be on the uh, be on camera, and uh, you know I appreciate that. But if you come out, I'm always going to ask you. You know if you want to be on the channel because like i always say this channel is about you guys there's nothing special about me i love fishing you guys love fishing this channel is about you it's always been about you it'll always be about you it's not about me uh you know it's just incredibly humbling so I have you guys come out and uh, and talk with me and to see the amount of people that come out and talk with me. So real quick, don't forget, make sure to come to Knoxville the 23rd through the 26th and make sure you come to the Augusta County uh, Fishing and Outdoors Expo in February and I've already forgot what days those are, but look it up. It's in Fishersville, Virginia. So come out and see me. I will be doing a Damiki uh, seminar at the Augusta County one. So come on out. We'll talk about everything that I know about Demeke Regan. As always, guys, questions and comments in the comment section below. You know I love to talk fishing with you. Any of the people that come out and see me at the uh, Raleigh Expo, they'll tell you, man, I can talk fishing all day long. So if you've got any questions, I absolutely mean it. If you've got questions, leave them in the bottom. Leave them in the description down there. Like it if you like it. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure you ring that bell, guys. It is so important that you like it up, leave comments, and uh, watch these videos every chance you get. It helps the channel out, helps the channel grow, helps stick that uh, down YouTube's algorithm's throat so that we can grow this channel. We're so close to 30,000. Help me share this channel out. Share some of your favorite videos out. Let's uh, let's cross that 30,000 mark. That's something I never would have thought my channel would have seen. And, and it, again, it's 100% because you guys, you guys rock.